Hey guys, RC here, back with episode 21. Um, where did we leave off last time? Somewhere up in here. I think. We talked about that. Destroyers and strongest. Okay, so uh, we beat Guab... God, dog it. Always click in the wrong place. We, <laughs> we beat Guabira 2-0. Uh, Miguel Rios was sent off in the 48th minute. We scored two goals after that, Gungora and Medina. Uh, then we beat Oriente 2-0. That was nice to get a little revenge. Luna Diali and Martinez, early goals. We were up 2-0 after five minutes. The strongest beat us 1-0, Delelo, with a goal. We beat Sport Boys 2-1. Right now, we are even with 26 wins for the best season uh, in club history. I think that's right. I think it was 26. But anyway, I think we're even with it. So one more win uh, puts us over the top in that category. And, of course, we have seven matches left. I don't think... I don't, think, I don't think that's going to be an issue. I hope I didn't just jinx this. Uh, so uh, we are back for Potosi and Pari today. Uh, again, I mentioned last episode, I've got a crap ton of stuff coming up in the next two weeks, uh, including basically a whole week out of town. So I have got uh, a lot of recording and rendering and editing. I've got to try to get done and I will do my best. But... You know, there that just may be a short video week. I, I may have to just take a semi-YouTube vacation for that week. And I'll, I'll have a few videos out, but it may not be daily. But we'll we'll give it a run, guys. We'll give it a run. All right, uh, so we are home. Uh, we are road favorites. It is breezy. So I have been riding this, this tactic for a while. Medina in for Herrera. Luna Diali on the outside. Oviedo is going to get a rest. Valdemar has moved him to the bench. So let's get to it. Let's see. Dressing room. Pick up where you left off. That works. We are in the red. Again, because I know I'm going to be out of town, I'm trying to get a lot of episodes recorded and ready to render. Uh, I've actually got one uploading and one rendering on my second computer right now. Uh, and that's typical. When I'm playing, I usually have one uploading and one rendering. So uh, I have not heard anything from you guys because uh, that episode hasn't even been rendered yet, let alone put up. But uh, these shorter episodes, uh, because I went to the uh, key highlights. Flores into the box. Martinez reaches double figures on scoring. Tenth goal of the season. 1-0. Very nice. We'll give him a little bit of praise on that. Nice little low cross. Looked like an Eddie Inkedia, uh goal for Leeds. Uh, with the low cross two, two inches from the net. Poor Patrick Bamford has to, you know, take high sh high crosses, uh, you know, out uh, out near the penalty spot, you know, off to the you know side of the goal, near the edge of the box, and you know then fans whinge that he he's not scoring twelve goals a match. <sighs> Fickle. Martinez, oh, he places it. There's number eleven. Ooh. Did he ask to get released? Oh, well, that's news. Whoa. Well, that was nice. Uh, breaking news from the NFL. So if you have followed the Antonio Brown saga, if you haven't, Google it. It's worth a laugh. Uh, he's an idiot. Let's just put it that way. Um the cryogenic chamber injury and the helmet saga that looks like it turned out just to be a, a marketing ploy to get a new endorsement deal. Uh, he threatened the general manager with violence and uh, 
ridiculed him. Now, if that had been the general manager doing that to the player because the GM's white and the player's black, I guarantee the GM would have been fired. Uh, the player, they decide to let play. The coach, Gruden, decides to let play, evidently. And uh, they they have fined him for that incident, though. They haven't. They weren't going to cut him, and now he's at been. He asked uh, today to be released. I hope they do, and I hope nobody ever signs him. I hope he never plays another down of football because he's stupid. Stupid, stupid to throw out the movie quote. All right, 2 nil, 14 shots to zero. Appreciate the efforts. But anyway, sorry. Normally I wouldn't have commented on that, but it just popped up on my news feed. Um, I have a friend of mine that's a Pittsburgh Steeler fan, so he's just, I know he's rolling over laughing. Oh, uh, into the box. Get it. Oh, Martinez. Oh, he fights through the keeper to get to the ball. That's a hat trick on the game. 12th goal of the season. I'm going to go ahead and pull him off. Let's put, uh, you know what? I'm going to put Gongora up there right now. Let's put Gongora up top. Oh, that was, that was nice. I haven't seen a fight like that in the box. Fernandez, too close. Slide tackle. The keeper nudged it. Martinez was about to tap it in there and then got to it a second time. Oh, that's nice. Very nice. All right, let's... Um, bum, bum, bum. Let's give Charamoni a little bit of time. We'll put him out on the wing. Well, we're picking up yellow cards. Come on, boys. Uh, da, da, da. In transition, out of possession. I'm going to take that off. And do we have anybody that hadn't really played a lot? Yeah, Villamil. How's your passing? You've got good passing. We'll put you in at defensive mid for Fernandez. Fernandez doesn't have the most stamina. It's a little bit of an early final sub, but that's all right. This should be a club record for wins, if what I was reading was right, or if I remember what I was reading. Flores. Medina. Running out the time now, boys. There's Villamil. Oh, look at that pass. The pass to eternity. Gotta like that. Appreciate the efforts. Good job. Quality of possession. Mark. Uh, oh, what do we want to do here? Next on red. There we go. Martinez, superb. All right, we're about a week away from the next match. We'll forward up to that. I just wanted to see if we got an email about our win record here. That should pop up right now if it, if it was if it was in fact reality. All right, he's suspended. No, well. All right, well, I'll be back for the next match in a minute, and maybe we'll get that email here popping up in a, in a minute. All right, we are back. Uh, no notification of the wins record, so maybe I misread that, or maybe we're a couple of wins away. I don't remember. Uh, I do know we were like one shutout away, and uh, so I don't know if we've equaled that or not. Sadie Flores is getting a call up for uh, the next two uh, senior matches uh, for Bolivia, so that's good. Uh, we are six up now on Wilsterman and cruising, so good deal, looking good. So let's get to it. Another win here we can equalize with Royal. That'll be nice. Start turning some of these around. 
Glad I was able to get Martinez some extra rest last match. Big, big match for him last time, that hat trick. All right. So this will probably be my last recording of the day. Got to get over to the television and get uh, get comfortable for uh, a marathon, what, 15 hours of viewing? No, um, probably about 10 hours of football today with a little UFC mixed in. I'm looking forward to it. All right, we've got seven shots. We're on attacking. All right, Flores into the box. Oh, the header's off target. All right, team instructions. Yeah, we've got get stuck in on already. Good. Let's tell them to get creative. They're not creating chances here. Only two on target. Um, we do have work the ball into the box. Let's work on some early crosses, maybe. Gee whiz. Disappointing. Yep, it was. Watch your step. Get creative. There's the Bolivian International with all of one cap, soon to be three, possibly. Okay, I said early crosses, not early shots. Um, I'm going to turn that off. Maybe, maybe instead of, oh, come on, fellas. I'll head it on, quick tap back. Good, good. Fernandez, oh, what a blast from Fernandez outside the box. Number seven on the season. That was in with a bullet. Woo, man. Bang! Still a long shot. Not, not happy with that, but yeah. All right, uh, Baldemar, let's go ahead and bring in Oviedo, give him some match time. Anybody really struggling? Juarez. Yeah, you know what? Let's yank him. I mean, he's certainly, I think he's the heart and soul of our team, Juarez. But, you know, you got to keep people on their heads and toes. Oh, Fernandez gets it in on the second attempt. Keeper with a good save, and then Fernandez just turned it around on him and put it across his face. Very nice. 2-0. I'm thinking that's going to 19-0. Didn't we shut him out on shots last match, too? Uh, we're just dominating teams right now. Siles. Oh, come on. Their guys score goals there all the time on, like, free breakaways. Sigardi, let's put him in. Um, actually, you know what? Hold on. Let's drop, uh, let's drop you back, and then you. Well, no, that's not going to work either. Um... Okay, yeah, that's fine. Boom. Done and dusted. Taken down in the box. Fernandez lining up for the penalty. Oh, well, he was. Sigardi is in for him. Who's Flores. Oh, he puts it under the keeper. Sadie Flores, his fifth of the season. Very nice. 3-0. That'll ink it. Uh, let's drop back to balance just to rest. Oviedo into the box. Oh, he just hoofed it. That was not a good pass. 
I don't know if that was on purpose, but it wasn't a good pass. 21 to 0 on shots, 10 to 0 on target, 14 to 0 on corners. Nice, nice. I'm very happy with that. And yeah, you got to say something assertive. Good performance. Don't let it go to your heads. There's always got one guy that's a hard hit in the locker room, right? He gets all pissed off. Oh my God. <laughs> Man United, scum, go top of the premiere. Sorry. Again, I'm a Leeds fan. Not a United fan. <laughs> All right, let's see here. Boom. Boom. Fernandez, two goals. Nice. All right, where are we? So, yeah, we're going to come back now for the season finale, Bolivar and San Jose. Uh, we are closing stage. We are nine up on the strongest. And that should set us in good stand for uh qualifying for the cup next year and we're also 10 up in the overall table that's crazy <laughs> so let's see if we look at the rules so the first and the second qualifying oh i'm sorry hold on the top team from the opening stage we finished fourth so we could win this one and that would be for the group stage. So we would automatically go to group with that. Then your league positions from the overall table, which we would finish first, you would get four teams, but we'd already have one. But if we somehow finish second in the closing stage, but still win overall, then we could still get into, a, I think, qualifying round. I think that's how it works. Anyway, uh, so, yep, we'll have uh, three more games off camera. We'll back, we're back for Bolivar, San Jose. Uh, how's the team looking? Uh, goals. So 14 and 12. We've actually got two goal scorers, 12 and 23, 14 and 39. Um the 12 and 23, I'm very happy with. 14, I'm happy with just from where he plays in that midfield. A lot of long shots there. But look at this. We've got a lot, three guys with eight or nine right on the verge of double figures. That's huge. That's huge. So very happy with the overall goal performance. We don't have one guy carrying us. Charimoni, only 3-15, a 1-5 guy this year. He's only been playing a 6-5-2. But everybody else is playing pretty well. Sadie Flores, an 8-0-6. Uh, so he'll be making his second cap for, uh, for Bolivia. He is wanted. Uh, I told him, no way in hell. Uh, and they did make an offer uh, during the last transfer window. I think we got up to 100 and. It was one hundred and twenty-five or one hundred and forty-five thousand um, dollars. You know, maybe one of the European clubs will come in with some big money for him. Uh, you know, we can get twenty million or something, and you know, I'll sell him for that. But you know, uh, yeah, he's not going anywhere in in South America uh, unless I just get to the point where I can't afford it. Uh, finances, we bled a little bit. We're down to 6.3, but we are making profit this month as of right now. We lost a little bit last month, but uh, we're looking solid here, fellas. Looking solid. Uh, don't think there's any jobs of note. A couple of, se ooh, a second division that's only two stars. They're 19th. That's not good. So they're going to get relegated. They're going to get relegated to third division, which is still number 11 in the continent. But that puts us into Brazil. Uh, they are basic below average, so they're not very good. Estimated value. Finances are okay.
their last coach just left the job. They haven't sacked one in a while since 2019. So in five years, four, four and a half years, they have not sacked a manager. But they've all left. I guess they either left before they got fired or... What's he doing? Oh, so yeah, he took another job. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, is in the second division. Really? So he jumped from a... Th <laughs> so he, he bailed on the sinking ship and jumped to the club that's got a shot to stay up, and they actually hired him. That's crazy. I'm tempted, guys. I am tempted. Because I really want to get to Brazil. Argentina's fine, but there's more Brazil activity happening right here. Two stars. I'm one and a half. That's at least close, right? Now, we're, the problem is we're valued at $2.49 million. But we're only a two-star national. Oh, what do I do here? Yeah, see, I mean, that's a million and a half dollars less in estimated value. But it's a better league. It's a better league, definitely, in second division. Even in third division, it's better. But it may not be a better job. But it gets us into Brazil. And the one thing I know is you kind of have to get your foot into the country in order to then move up in that country, right? Um, facilities, we have a 13,000 all-seater. We are paying rent. We haven't even applied for the job yet. Below average youth. Uh, key player. Don't know anything about him, but he is a winger. Eight goals in 33. So a one in four guy. Hot prospect, Alberto. Center back. <clears throat> Even if they fall to third, right? Even if they fall to third. And they are a two-star. I'm, I'm not going to declare interest. I'm just going to apply. I'm going to apply and see what happens. Um, mm, yeah, I'm not going to I'm not going to go overboard. The interview process is over. Well, why in the fuck is it still showing up? It says available. Hello. Hello. Well, shit, now I want to go here. <laughs> They're 19th. They're going to get sent down. 19th. What's the rules here? 42, oh, 42 game season. That is such a long year. That is such a long year. All right. Disciplinary rules, promotion. Top three go to Superliga. So there is no relegation. Okay. We don't qualify for anything internationally. That's sad. So that may want that may keep me from going there. Third division. Rules. Yeah, right here. Qualification. Haiti is a non foreign country to Brazil, really? All right. Not sure how the uh, not sure how that works, but that's okay. 
So we play 18 games here. 42 is just a long season. Yeah, I don't want to get tied up in that, I don't think. Well, that's disappointing. I'm 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 actually upset that it won't uh That sucks. Well, do I apply for that one? They're they're a three star. They're not going to hire me. All right. Well, let's move on. Again, I got to finish my badge. I just took a flyer on that because they were two star. I talked myself into it. But uh, once I become a two or two plus star, then I think I can start looking at two and a half and three star jobs. Uh, you know, like this one right here with CBR. Uh, you know, if it becomes and there, you know, there's a few clubs in here that uh, that might be might be coming in all right guys well that's it hit the like button subscribe we'll see you next time for the season the closing stage finale bye god i can't believe they wouldn't even offer me an interview or even look at my application they just round filed it bummer